and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is a vlog. I want to get some things done today. Um, I have to go to the supermarket first of all and I want to sort out all of the baby clothing today and start washing them. But first I need to clean the washing machine with some baking soda. I think I will do that right now. So I'm currently in my third trimester so the time really flies. So I want to get things done today and yeah I'm gonna take you guys along so if you're excited for a new vlog please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and if you're new here on my channel welcome I'm a Dutch girl and I'm living in Marmaris Turkey and I'm currently pregnant with my first baby so I'm making now a lot of uh, pregnancy related videos lifestyle and vlogs so if you like that make sure you subscribe as you can see I just got myself ready I just put a very natural makeup look on but it's very hot so I'm already sweating <laughs> so hopefully I put enough powder on my face um, but I think I'm gonna first go to the supermarket to get some things and uh, yeah let's go So I just went to the supermarket and I got just a few bits. I got some lactose free uh, milk, some uh, whole wheat bread, some Turkish yogurt, some mushrooms and also some um, hazelnuts. So I'm going to put the washing machine on 90 degrees Celsius, the highest uh, temperature on my washing machine so that all of the bacteria die and then after I can wash all of the baby clothing. So I was going through all of the baby stuff and I realized that I haven't showed you guys uh, some of the things. Um, I got some really nice presents from my sister and my grandma and um, I thought I'd just share them with you because they are just too cute. So for my sister I got this caterpillar book and a toy. Um, in Dutch it's called Rupsje Nooit Genoeg and I believe in English it's called the caterpillar something. I'm not really sure but I will link it down below. It is very famous and uh, yeah I got this little toy from her which is so cute and then the book as well and this is like uh, really cute because it got all of these little as you can see flowers that you can open with all different animals so I think uh, babies will really enjoy this um, so yeah this I got from my sister and then I also got this t-shirt which is like typical my sister with top baby <laughs> from Topken um, I think it's very cute and then also this t-shirt with this baby rocks from ECDC, which is just hilarious. And then my favorite game, Mario Kart, this cute t-shirt. Then I also got these bottles from Philips Avent. So they are just regular bottles, I guess. And then also this dinosaur and this little toy for uh, in the bath. And my sister says that he needs to have a dinosaur, so she got me a dinosaur and this really cute little uh, toy. Then I also got two extra um, pacifiers. This is a different brand. This is called Defrax. Um, as you can see, this is from zero to um, six months. The shape of this looked very nice. Um, it's not near the nose. So maybe I can use this um, the first few months. I will have a look. So I got a dark navy one and also a, a terracotta one. Then from my grandma, I got this Nantje uh, Mifi soft toy. Um, in other countries it's called Mifi, but in the Netherlands we say Nijntje. Um, it's very cute. It has a really cute like minty uh, suit on. And it got also a little sound to it. So yeah, very, very cute. And then I also got um, this one, which is like a little uh, one piece with a um, elephant on it. And I think that's so adorable. And then with this matching one as well. So very adorable. And then lots of clothing um, in all different sizes, which I'm very, very happy with. 
Um, so let's get started with the uh, coats or jackets. This is a size 62. So this will be perfect for in the fall. It's a really nice soft material and um, it's a really nice bright yellow. And then this one, my husband says it's a bit girly, but I don't care. I think a boy can wear this as well. It reminded me of Bambi and I think this coat is just so cute for the winter time. This is a size um, 68. So this will be perfect um, for the winter. And then lots of little leggings, um, which you can't get enough, I think. This really lovely beige color which goes with everything and I really love like beige brown tones for a boy then just a simple plain white one and then a blue one as well a dark grey one and then two with prints so this one with all little animals on it so cute and this one also got some lions and tigers on it. And this goes really well with the coats. Very bright. Then I love this one. This goes great with the um, beige leggings, I think. With these ones. Very adorable. And then this one is very cute as well. It got all little uh, mushrooms on it. Yeah, I love boys in uh, these kind of colors. And then this really cute grey cardigan, which is so cute for the winter time. And then, oh, this one is very cute as well. It got all little dogs on it. How cute is this? I love this print. And then, uh, oh, this one is also very, very nice. It's a very different material. It's, it's really soft. I don't know how to explain it, but I love it. Look at that. That will be very cute as well with the um, beige uh, leggings. Then this one with all little suns and uh, little squares. This is also a little bit of a bigger size. This is a size um, 68 I believe. So again this will be perfect for the uh, winter time. And then this one which is very very thick. So yeah, this will be perfect when it's very cold here. And this is also um, six months, I believe. So you can wear this um, in the winter. So um, yeah, I'm very happy with all of it. And I'm so spoiled with all of the presents. I mean, they're so cute. And I love to have a book as well because I didn't own a book yet. And um, so I can read to him, which I think is just so nice. So very thankful for the presents that I got. So now we're just going to sort everything out and start washing the stuff. I think I will start with the whites and uh, lighter colors. And then uh, I will put all of the dark colors together. Because I'm very scared that if I put some colors together that it will all mix together and that it will mess everything up. So I will have a look. I will maybe check Google and see what I can find. I think the best way is just to put the whites, beige colors, and then the darker tones together. And obviously I have some brighter things. So maybe I will put them in a hand wash. I don't know. Um, yeah, I will have a look. So I just put everything here on the bed in the nursery. And I'm going to sort everything by color. Um, like blankets and like white, beige and darker colors and i think some of these items i will wash by hand and then later i will put everything together anyway i guess and i also have those color catchers so i can always use um, those as well <laughs> Okay, so here I got all whites and really light beige shades. Then I got the muslins um, here and the blankets as well. I guess I'm going to wash them all together. Then here are the beige tones and browns. Um, I guess I can also mix them together. Then I have gray and mint. And I think I'm going to wash them together with the blue colors. 
I'm not sure. I'm really scared that the colors will go everywhere. And then here I have all of the darker items. And then um, these ones that I'm going to wash by hand. So I just threw all of the white clothing items and also some blankets. Um, together in the washing machine and my sister-in-law recommended this to me this is a, a very natural soap that is very soft and um, so perfect for baby clothing so i'm going to use a little bit of this i think you don't need too much and then i also got these color catchers that i will use um, by the other items i think here i don't need it because it's all white but and for the gray and blue ones and for the darker colors i can definitely use uh, one of these So I just did my first wash and um, these things I still have to do so I will um, do that in the next couple of days and I also wash some items by hand, some darker items. So yes, these items I will wash in the uh, next couple of days so that everything is nice and fresh. And in here everything is empty right now and um, so when everything is clean i will organize everything again and i will put everything um, by size so um, then i will give you guys a full tour of how i organized everything so for lunch today i'm going to make some whole wheat pasta this is my favorite go-to lunch at the moment and i'm going to add some mushrooms uh, with creamy sauce and some chicken so yeah that's what i'm having for lunch today vlog right here i really hope you guys enjoyed it if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up because you really helped my channel with that and don't forget to subscribe and i hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos bye